what first thing women to say to us is, where does it say in the Bible that a wife got to stay at home? Don't say nowhere. You know what I'm saying? That thing, that thing ain't got nothing to do with the Bible. Why ain't got to stay at home? Proverbs even said a wife works. Yeah, yeah. Oh, goodness. Y'all want to talk about a virtual woman? Grab, uh, let's grab. Let's Proverbs 31. We'll get up out of here. I didn't know y'all wanted to talk about a virtual woman now. Goodness gracious. These people be having it all wrong. Yeah. It's Proverbs chapter 31. Is it 30 or 31? It it's Proverbs chapter 31. You can go ahead and start at verse 1. We really started at verse 5. Well, you started at verse 1. Well, yeah, it's all good. It's Proverbs chapter 31, verse 1. Let's hear about a virtuous woman. They be getting this thing all wrong. People be with, listen, these Christians read this thing all the time. They read all the time. They ain't pay attention to what they darn read. You know, you know what they start? They see virtuous. They go, oh, that's that. <laughs> Look at God. Oh, goodness. They just see virtuous. All the rest of that stuff is just mumbo darn jumbo to them. It's just virtuous. Let's read about this woman. Let's see what makes her virtuous. No. Verse 10. No, I want verse 1. Yeah, I want verse one. Let's read it. The words of King Lemuel, the uh -huh. prophecy that his mother taught him. Mm -hmm. That his mother what? Taught him. What that mean? Mom, she was a prophet. She was a prophet. Saw a vision. Or a dream. What you talking about? That's another one they'll use. See? The virtual woman, she taught. Let me tell you, that thing gonna get you under two conditions. One, right? That was her baby. Right? A woman can't teach a what? Man. She can teach her son. She can teach a baby at least. She can't teach her grown son. She can teach her baby. She can teach her child. Right? And then two, what does she teach? Not a prophecy. Well, that's straight from God. That thing ain't written. That ain't Bible. You know what I'm saying? That thing didn't become it. That, that thing didn't become Bible until she said it. Yeah. Right? She spoke word. All right, keep going. What my son, and what the son of my womb, and what the son of my bowels. Uh -huh. Give not thy strength unto women, nor thy ways to that which destroys kings. Mm -hmm. it, is not, it is not for kings, O Lemuel. It is not for kings to drink wine, nor for princes strong drink. Mm -hmm. Lest they drink and forget the law and pervert the judgment of any of the, or of any of the afflicted. Hello. Keep going. <laughs> Give strong drink unto him that is ready to perish, and wine unto those that be of heavy hearts. Right? When you when you darn sad and depressed, right? She said, go ahead and get wine to them. Right? Dang, you know what I'm saying? I, don't, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I ain't talking, I ain't, I ain't talking about that. I ain't talking about that. But I'm just saying, that what she's trying, she just trying to tell you. You get wine to the people that got heavy heart. They're going through something. Right? Get wine to the people that's ready to perish. Strong drink to the people that are ready. I mean, they just ready to get up out of here. Go ahead and give it to them. It's not for a leader. It's not for somebody that got to make decisions. Keep going. Let him drink and forget his poverty and remember his misery no more. Open thy womb for the dumb in the cause of all such as are appointed to destruction. Mm -hmm. Open thy mouth for the dumb in the cause of all such as are appointed to destruction. Mm -hmm. Open thy mouth, judge righteously, and plead the cause of the poor and needy. Mm -hmm. Who can find a virtuous woman? Who can find a virtuous woman? For her price is far above rubies. Mm. That's where they stop. That's where the Christians stop. <laughs> no, they keep they keep reading, but in their mind, that's where they stop. They, they ain't got past the rubies yet. They weighed down on verse what? What's the last verse? Mm. The, the one we read, Tim. No, what's the last verse of the chapter? 31. They right, they way down like verse 25. They still think about she don't surpass rubies. I mean, way past the price of rubies. Keep going, watch this. The heart of her husband does safely trust in her so that he shall have no need of spoil. Okay. She will do him good and not evil all the days of her life. Okay. She seeks, she seeketh wool and flax and works willingly with her hands. She does what though? Works willingly with her hands. That thing don't say, listen, that didn't come from no Bible that a woman got to stay at home. That came from men. Right? 
A man said that. A man said, you know what? I don't want you out there, you know what I'm saying, doing that. I want your butt to sit at home. That thing ain't come from no Bible. Bible ain't never mandate that. The Bible ain't never even gave no, no representation of that. You've never seen it in the Bible where a woman just stay at home and that's all. Like Ruth worked. Yeah. Ruth Bud got out there and worked. She, she was considered a, a righteous woman. Mary, Martha, they butts got out there and worked. I don't know. Let's see. Keep going. <laughs> she is like the merchant ships. She brings her food from afar. Mm -hmm. She rises also while it is yet night and gives meat to her household and a portion of her maidens. You know what that means? She rises what? She rises also while it is yet night and gives meat to her household and a portion to her maiden. What that sound like? Good Christian, Christian don't be reading it. You know, you gotta read it. What that sound like? She rises what? She she rises also while it is yet night and gives So she meat. rises also while it's still night. And gives meat to her household and a portion to her maiden. So getting that lamb ready, cutting it up. She wake up early in the morning while it's still dark. Cooking breakfast. Right? My mom used to do that thing. You know what I'm saying? We used to go to school. My mom be up in the kitchen. You know what I'm saying? Still dark. I, I, wake, I used to wake up. I always wake up early. My mom be up in there with the grits. You know what I'm saying? The foul bacon and everything. You know what I'm saying? We wake up for school. Sit your butt. My mom was mean though. You know what I'm saying? Sit your butt starting down. Sit at that table. Just that nothing. But mom took care of us though. You know what I'm saying? Mom, you know what I'm saying? It was like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? She had a whole plate. You know what I'm saying? Every darn morning for school. For a while. That's what's up. She stopped doing that thing after a while. Dang it. Like that. You know what I'm saying? But mom used to do that thing every darn morning. My mom was busy. You know what I'm saying? We got little slices of virtuous women. You know what I'm saying? You know, little slices. Mm -hmm. Because nobody's taught it. Mm -hmm. Right? Once a woman be able to look at it like, okay, I understand my value, my real value. Not this fake stuff. Not all this stuff the world try to put in my brain of what a woman should be and all this. I understand what the most high God expects. I understand what the most high God says is my value. You look at that and then you learn what a virtual woman is, a lot of our women can pick up. Now what the what the book's saying is not it's not it's not it's not a lie. Right? None of us should, should feel bad like if our woman or if we are not this. It's not a lie. He told you. That thing ain't gonna that thing ain't gonna be easy to find now. That's a rare thing, that's a special thing. Right? That thing ain't gonna be easy. I mean we just got, you know, say we just got. But we can at least look at it and say, okay, how many of these can I check off? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? How many of these can I check off? Personally, I think I feel like the women, you know what I'm saying? At least they get theirs like all in one place, you know what I'm saying? We got to search the whole book to kind of figure out how to be a man. Like, all right, let's get a little bit. All right, Abraham did this, you know what I'm saying? They got their, they got a summary version. Like, ah, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> check, I mean. check, 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 check. Like, goodness. You know what I'm saying? Where the virtuous man at? That's all right, though. <laughs> yeah, I'm all right. You know what I'm saying? Keep going. She considers a field and buys it with the fruit of her hand. She what? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. She got a whole Hold on, hold on. Tell, tell, me, tell me about the part where she went in her husband's bank account. <laughs> <laughs> Tasha, hold on. Come here. Baby, wake up. Book being preached. Goodness gracious, tell me, hold on. Tell me how thy bank account was used. Go ahead, show me. She it's considered a, a field and buy Listen, hold on. She walked out there. She said, oh, that's a nice field. Oh, no, 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 baby. You go ahead. <laughs> I'll take it. Let me tell you. Virtuous, darn woman. Goodness gracious. Let me see here. Let me hear something else. With the fruit of her hands, she plants a vineyard. With the fruit of her hands. Right? She bought the field with the fruit of her own hands. So in other words, she got the money. It was her own money. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? She worked. It already told you she'd be working. She worked. She got the money. She bought the vineyard. And then from the fruit of her own hands, she planted that day. So she paid for all that stuff. All right, keep going. She girds her loins with strength and strengthens her arms. Mm -hmm. She perceives that her merchandise is good. Her candle goes not out by night. Mm -hmm. She lays her hands to the spindle and her hands hold the distaff. Look, look at that. She's sewing together stuff. You know what I'm saying? Keep going. <gasps> Keep going. She stretches out her hand to the poor. Yea, she reaches forth her hands to the needy. She is not afraid of, of the snow for her household, for all her household are clothed with scarlet. She makes See, that thing don't bother her. It's cold outside. Oh, my whole family prepared. 
That thing don't bother her one bit. All right, keep going. She makes herself coverings of tapestry. Her clothing is silk and purple. Her husband is known in the gates when he sits among the elders of the land. Mm -hmm. She makes fine linen and sells it and delivers girdles unto the merchants. Look, I'm going to tell you. What does the virtuous woman sound like to us? She works. That sounds like a business woman. Mm -hmm. Don't let these people confuse y'all about what we dealing with here. Don't let anybody confuse you. Oh, the woman got to stay at home. Our women choose, right? You choose to stay at home or we work it out in our marriage and we say this is what makes sense. Where well, that's fine. But don't make it seem like that thing coming from the Bible. <laughs> right. Right. Don't, I don't say that. I'm just saying. They, they try to throw that thing at the Bible. Now, don't put that stuff on the Bible. Sometimes that thing just work out. Right. Sometimes it just work out, it work out better. It's easier that way. You know what I'm saying? It just work out. You know what I'm saying? We don't trust these systems with our kids. We like our wives to have more time with our kids so that they can be, you know what I'm saying, they can put this stuff in our kids. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes kids need a little bit more care. You know what I'm saying? It makes sense for our wife to stay home, take care of the kids. That makes sense. Right? At the same time, though, virtual woman. She out there. She probably she probably ain't got no job either. She running the business. Ain't that what it say? Yeah. All right, let's look at it again. Read that one more time for me. She makes herself coverings of tapestry. Her clothing is silk and purple. And then what she do with it? Her husband is known in the gates, and when he sits among the elders of the land, she makes fine linen and sells it. She does. She makes fine linen and does what? And sells it. This whole time, y'all ain't even been paying attention to what's been going on. Right? This whole time it started off talking about, yeah, she be working with her own hands. Right? Then it go on down and it said, she look at the field and she considers it. And then with the fruit of her own hands, she plants it. Then it came later and it started telling you about a spindle. She had a spindle. Okay, then all of a sudden, she got these clothes. She makes sure her whole house got clothes for the snow. Then after that, she said, you know what? I'm going to sell this extra that I got. She's a businesswoman. She looked at the field and she said, that's what I want. She planted the stuff. She, she, she planted some flax she, uh, from the spindle. She made linen. Then she took the linen, provided for her whole household. Then after she got done with that, she said, I'm selling all the extra. Then I might just go buy another field. What you talking about? Man, let's keep reading. What you think I'm not going to be doing when she looking at this stuff? She don't offer up. is natural. Definitely spending all your money. But that's alright. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? We got little slices. You know what I'm saying? You gotta give them a break. We gotta learn how to be men. You know what I'm saying? You can't, you know what I'm saying? It's like, you know what I'm saying? But the, we, you know, I'm just saying we there though. You know what I'm saying? It's like it's there. We, uh, we see the pieces. We just gotta learn it. We gotta be able to look at it and be like, who gonna teach us the truth about us? Keep going. Strength and honor are her clothing, and she shall rejoice in time to come. Mm -hmm. She opens her mouth with wisdom, and in her tongue is the law of kindness. Mm -hmm. She looks well to the ways of her household and eats not the bread of idleness. Uh huh. Her children arise up and call her blessed. She, hold on. She, hold on. She look. We'll back it up for me a little bit. This is some important stuff. Yeah, yeah. Back it up for me a little bit. She looks we well starting to read the this thing like Christmas. Household. She looks what? Well to the ways of her house. Now back it up before that. She opens her mouth with wisdom, and in her tongue is the law of kindness. She opens her mouth with wisdom, right? So whenever that question come up, whenever it's time to consider her words, she's making sure she's saying something that makes sense, is wise. That's important. She opens her mouth with wisdom, and in her mouth is the what? The law of kindness. Keep going. She looks well to the ways of her household and eats not the bread of idleness. Okay. Her she eats not what? The bread of idleness. She not sitting around. She not sitting there farting and pooping all day. She's trying to figure out what's the next thing. How do we make it happen? What do you think Danielle's out here doing? Mm. Mm. Say that. <laughs> say that. Say that. <laughs> right? She's looking for it. She's looking up all these different things. All right, do terror, this, that, and other. Now, you know what I'm saying? We got to get to the point where she ain't spending all this money, but that's all right. You know what I'm saying? It's like, you know what I'm saying? We ain't hundred percent there yet, but we working. You know what I'm saying? We, we got something going on, right? I tried to get Tasha to stay at home. 
I'm like, you know what I'm saying? You good. You know what I'm saying? You all right? You know what I'm saying? We got two now. Why don't you just relax? How long that thing last? Her C-section wasn't even healed yet. Listen, uh, I'm just going to take a part-time job. That, that part-time job lasted about a month or two. I went ahead and went full-time. I said, well, you got it. She like to work with her own hands. She like to have her own money. Right? These are all pieces of a virtual woman. We just haven't, we haven't been taught as men how to teach our women how to be this. We haven't been taught how to teach them their value so they can be secure in being a woman and not have to feel like, you know what, in order for me to have value, in order for me to, to, to have power, I need to act like a man or be like a man or be well, there's a, or emulate certain pieces of a man. No. That's what the world will have us believe. Right? That the world have a believe all that stuff and that puts us in the awkward. That takes away from our opportunity to be more. Or not our, but y'all's opportunity, a woman's opportunity to be more of a virtuous woman. But we can see it's natural. It's in our women. You can just see it. Little pieces of it here and there. Right? We just got to grow until we get to, you know what I'm saying, that full thing. Keep going. Watch this. People ain't teaching no darn book. Her children arise up and call her blessed, her husband also, and he praises her. Uh huh. Many daughters have done virtuously, but thou excellest them all. Mm -hmm. Favor is deceitful, mm -hmm. and beauty is vain. Mm -hmm. But a woman that fears the Lord, she shall be praised. Mm -hmm. Give her of the fruit of her hands, and let her own works praise her in the gates. Just give me what I just give me what I deserve. Give me what I work for, and don't worry about it. That thing will work out. Right? That's a virtuous woman. Whoever, whoever, whoever read this before? Read it before, right? It didn't sound like it did tonight, huh? Because we read stuff and we get to, stuff get taught to us and then we read it. So when we read it, you know what we was looking for the whole time we read it? We were looking for that beauty is vain part. You got certain Christian parts in there. That whole part in the middle ain't no, I've never, my entire life, I've never heard nobody quote none of it. Listen, I, when I read this thing, I was looking like, oh, this is a businesswoman. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I, looking, yeah. I read it there, I was like, oh, this is not, this is not what I thought. Right. Oh, she's so kind to her husband and she treats him right. She be, and she, she, oh, and she, oh yeah, she do all that too. At the end of the day though, I ain't even got time to be seeing her argue with my husband. I'm out here getting the, I'm out here making it happen. What the husband gonna say? Are you bringing the camera? You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna say nothing. And you waking up early before, and you making bread? Oh, the husband, trust me, husband ain't got nothing to darn say. Better shut your darn mouth. She the one that's taking care of business. All right? Our book is not, our book is not what these people try to make it out to be. Like this sexist thing. That's not what our book is. Don't let these people confuse. We know what our books say. 